Hey guys, welcome to when, uh, Friday's workout for this week. So we're going to start down on the ground. We're going to open up our spine. We're going to take the edge of our chair or bench box, whatever we have access to. We're going to place our palms flat on the box or, or the bench or the chair. Walk our knees back. We're going to sit our bum back into our heels. Drive that head and chest down through those arms and hold two deep breaths. And then gently back up into the center. Sit back, drive the head and chest through. Two deep breaths, push it down all the time. Back into the center. We're going to do five reps with them in total. Then we're going to go and we're going to go into our splits work. So, sliding that front heel as far away from our back knee as possible. Leaning that chest forward and down towards the front knee. Try and get that back knee as far away from us as we can. Accumulate 30 seconds on your right side, 30 seconds on your left. Once you've that done, we're going to come up on our feet. And we're going to go lunge into some rotations. We're going to do 10 total, five on each leg. So we're going to lunge, knee down, hands to the floor, sweep, rotate, and lunge back up. Lunge down with the opposite leg, knee down, hands to the floor, sweep, rotate, lunge back up, and change sides. Okay, hands to the floor, sweep, rotate, and lunge back. So five inside, ten in total, and get through three rounds of that warm up, just to loosen everything up, fire all the muscles, get ready to go. Today's Metcon guys, something a little bit different. We're gonna go four rounds, and we are not gonna get a rest at all during these four rounds. So I wanna test your um, endurance a little bit today. So everything should be done at a nice steady pace, imagining our vision that we're gonna be working for 12 minutes here. So we don't wanna redline at any point during those first three rounds. Okay, so we need to pick a nice, manageable, sustainable pace. Again, like if we were going for a 5K jog, we wanna manage those first few kilometers so that we can survive those last one or two. Okay, so. This is just a little bit more endurance, not having that rest there, but just keep this movement in a steady state. So in minute one, we're gonna do as many step ups as possible. Two feet up, two feet down, body weight only is fine. If anybody does wanna add a little bit more intensity, they can do box jumps instead if they think they'll be able to manage that intensity without getting a rest. Once one minute goes, we're gonna come down to the ground and we're gonna go into our Russian twists. Feel free to do these body weight if you have nothing um, light to do them with. So just using your hands, tapping them off the floor, keeping your legs off the ground, core nice and tight. If you've got something light, like a very light dumbbell or some small object at home. Okay, you can incorporate that into the Metcon if you want. Okay, try and pick something that you're maybe only needing to take one rest within that second minute of work. Once we've that done then, we're gonna turn around and we're gonna go into a push-up hold. So while we're a little bit fatigued and a little bit out of breath from the step-ups, and the Russian twist, we're gonna see what your upper body strength endurance is like in a static position. So hands directly under your shoulders, tuck your pelvis under, keep the glutes engaged. Notice how my hands are directly under my shoulders. Do not weigh here out in front to represent that push-up. Core, glutes, lats, shoulders, pecs, everything's engaged. Going for that full third minute in a static position, trying to control that heart rate, get it back down, after a minute, we're going to go straight back up and into our seconds. Okay, to start round two. Today, just to keep some sort of score, we're going to count our step ups and our Russian twists. Okay, are going to go towards our score. So each step up, or if you're doing box jumps, box jumps will go towards our score. And then on the Russian twists, today we're going to count left plus right as one. Left plus right as two, and so on. Over our four rounds, guys, see can you pick an intensity and a pace that you can sustain for the four minutes without having to take very much rest at all. The only thing we should really be seeing you need to break up 
is maybe to rush and twist if you're falling out of a good position or a good posture and just need a few breaths to reset and go again that's perfectly fine we would expect that but on the step ups and on the push up hold we want to see those done unbroken for all four rounds transition straight into a new round as quick as we can and get moving but at a nice slow tempo okay guys so a little bit different pace today four rounds counter step ups or box jumps counter rush and twists left plus right is one rep left plus right is two reps and so on give this a go hope to see you on zoom thanks for watching